you back at all up when I find this mother. It's okay, baby. It's gonna be all right. But it's not okay. And it's not all right. The autopsy says she was pregnant. What kind of coward kills a pregnant woman? I don't get it. Mm. I ever tell you she bought me my first basketball. Mm. I was supposed to make it to the NBA and get her out of this. And now look, how am I supposed to get her out? My sister got him.
I'm talking about you hanging out with a girl that slept with half the basketball team. <laughs> Well, now you know I'm not even like that. How am I supposed to know? Birds of a feather flock together and you hanging out with her. What? Man, forget you. Forget me? Yeah, I'm tired of this. You're always tripping about something. Oh, I'm tripping. We're going to see who tripping. <laughs> Reflects bad 
on group one. Honor and obligation controlled me, and custom was stronger than law. There are certain things we do not do because we are not that kind of a people. Because the psychological jail of depending on someone else for religion, culture, and image is a more binding jail than any steel can erect for you. How did we become a dependent people for an independent people? Why have so many messengers came among us and we have not heard their message? Why have we started fights where there were no fights? In what we have to do in order to restore ourselves and prepare ourselves for nationhood again.
At age 14, she already had mental whelps. But she knew there had to be a right because the growing pains had her with nothing left. The shudder of her eyes had caught glimpses of death. The utter of her cries echoes and smothers the temptress with huffs of her breath weeping. Help. I need somebody's help. Won't somebody help? But she ain't got no help. Breaks from her stepdad's Jekyll and in her he hides himself. Mom tries to save face thinking that she can hide herself. And it's a hard step if you listen hard enough you can hear their souls and spirits conflict. To live life is not to fear it. As time goes on she has no sight of her purpose and can't seem to get near it. But by high school she was getting attention from her pom-poms cheering. But she was no cheerleader. Hanging with the jocks, the thoughts, and the tweakers. Blew her boyfriend's brains out for trying to beat her. She said no man will ever put his hands on me again.
Mm. Oh, God. Mm. 